All right. So um, I've just been prepping all the chi cast forecasting for November, and I've got a different video out for that for a free one you can get. But I wanted to do another message too and, talk, and just sort of give you a heads up for those of you that aren't on my Chi Cast tribe just yet. We are heading into a very emotional month. It's something very unique occurred when I was looking at prepping the, the forecasting that I do for everyone every month. And there was a repeat of the hexagrams and it caught me unawares. I had to actually go and double check all my work. I thought I'd made a mistake. And it's reminding me that we're not through something. We're not done with something. And I know that, you know, we're all going to feel a little bit burned out, a little bit overworked. Um, our foundation is going to be a little bit wobbly because we're going into our, it's called Shin Hai, which is Yin Metal Pig Month. And this is a lot of water. And water often is, you know, communication and wisdom and so many wonderful things. But we're going into a cooler part of the year, metaphysically. And that takes away our fire, which is our hope and our inspiration, and our love and everything. So Know that you are feeling a little bit wobbly. So are the people around you. So for goodness sake, give out more of those hugs. Connect in with people. Check in with people if you haven't heard from them. And just know that it's okay. It's a moment in time. It will pass. But it's a, a, it's a bit of a mobile month. Things are going to be moving now. If I can give you one thing, I would say, remember that everything happens for you, not to you. And obstacles are often there for a reason. And we sometimes get caught up with thinking, oh my God, that's just, oh, it's another problem in my way. You know what? It's not in your way. Get rid of that way of thinking. It's not in your way. It's there for a reason. And I know it doesn't make sense. And you're probably, you know, wanting, you're probably giving me a finger right now. I get it. I get it. I'm sorry. But when we have these obstacles, they are there to show us that we've got some growth to do that maybe we didn't do something quite correctly. And sometimes, yes, the obstacle is placed there by somebody else and we feel like saying, what the hell? How did I get your obstacle? Well, the fact is you did. So deal with it. And I'm not gonna say positive mindset, just imagine that obstacle gone because that doesn't fully work. But your mindset is everything this month. How you approach November, um, is setting up future years to come. Because if you remember at the beginning of the year, I warned you that every month this year equals a year in the future. Since February, we've been laying out the next 12 years. So we've got a very important year under our belt. And we've done marvelous to get to this point because it's been a bit of a gong show year, right? The best thing I can say is, Stay informed, stay with me, get your monthly forecast so you know what's coming, get your update so you know what's coming in 2023. But more importantly, right now, just get through November, be with your friends and know that you're, if you're feeling a little bit wobbly, so is the person next to you. So if you unite with them, if you stand together with them, you will find a firm footing. All right, off you go.